John, we're at Bradford City Legends Day. You are a Bradford City legend. It must always be nice to meet up with some of your old teammates and reminisce on the times gone by. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do that after. Uh, no, it, it's great that the, the club are sort of uh, having days like this and remembering the ex-players as such because, I mean, a lot of other clubs do it. And it's uh, it's great for us ex-players to get back together, have a bit of banter, not only that, get amongst the, the supporters as well, because it's about them as well. And the club at the minute, a real positive vibe about City. It's been a good start to the year, hasn't it? Yes, absolutely. Obviously, I mean, Phil left in the summer and there was a lot of wondering what was going to happen. Stuart has come in and I think it's fair to say he's, he's done a fantastic job up to now. Are you surprised, Stuart? I mean, obviously, he came back. It didn't quite work for him the first time, did it? Are you surprised he, he took the chance or do you feel he wanted just to prove him that he could do it? No, I'm not surprised whatsoever. Uh, it's <laughs> To manage Bradford City, his club is a golden opportunity for him. So uh, it was just a matter of the new owners coming in and saying, right, OK, they're prepared to give him an opportunity because as well as it's been good for Bradford City, it's a fantastic opportunity for Stuart as well. So, no, not in the least bit surprised. He's got, he's got more under his belt now. He's more mature, he's more experienced. He knows the coach and managerial side a wee bit more than we did all those years ago. So uh, let's hope it ends well. And what about your favourite time at, at Bradford? Come on, give us your best one. Oh, so many. Uh, I mean, uh, when I first came to Bradford, I'd been let go to Coventry City, and it was a matter of going to the right place at the right time. And from day one, I was just accepted by not just in the dressing room, by the supporters as well. And it took my, it took me as a footballer on the next tier as such. You know, nothing but happy times at a club. Fantastic times. And, it was, and just with young boys as well, mixed with experienced pros, your, your Bobby Campbells, your John Hollies. For us, just linking together, it was just magical. And certainly the team spirit we had in those days, you don't replicate very often. <laughs>